Well, after a busy fire season, recent rain and snow are helping firefighters in the Black Hills. But as Kelloland Sydney Thorson explains, even as temperatures fall, fires are still a threat in western South Dakota. Some parts of the Black Hills have already received more than two feet of snow. State Fire Meteorologist Darren Claybo says it's having a positive effect. And that snow is just kind of settling in, it's moistening up all the fuels, and even the prairie areas that just got the rain, it really mitigated the overall fire danger. New Underwood Fire Chief Caleb Dustman is also a rancher. He says the snow came at a great time. If that ground freezes up with a good layer of moisture in it, it'll help uh, when that comes back and thaws in the spring, it'll help give the grass and crops a good jump start. While the recent rain and snow has helped with moisture out here in the Black Hills, the fire danger level remains very high today. The precipitation, you know, one to three inches across a widespread area over western South Dakota was definitely beneficial. It's allowed that moisture to soak into the ground, soak into the fuels, moisten everything up. But looking out over the next two to four weeks, we are going to dry back out. So our fire potential will definitely increase going through the rest of October and into early November. So we have temporary relief right now, um, but there is some potential for some drying in the future. So local fire departments, including New Underwood, are staying prepared. We're not out of the woods yet. Um, the moisture has been a great help, but we've had a couple warm days. Uh, it's windy out today. You know, the danger is still there. In the Black Hills, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News. Fire officials say this time of year, departments tend to see more structure fires, so it's important to make sure your home is equipped for all kinds of fire danger. No, seriously.